All right, it's Friday morning. <clears throat> we are on our way to the workhouse. It is 4.32 a.m. Um, nothing, nothing out of the ordinary today. Just another Friday. Um, I feel like it's been a busy week, but I guess really only yesterday was anything outside of the normal routine. And that went off pretty, pretty well. Um, yeah. Got my got my walk in and my abs in and came in and fed my father and fed myself and gave him a shower and got to the VA and did our lab work and came on home. Actually stopped on the way home. Got Walt a Diet Pepsi and uh, that's a rare treat for him to have a soda. Uh, had my had a little cash, so we've got some scratch-offs. And, um, I guess that was about it. So, today's going to be more of the same. <laughs> um, after work, we'll drop off some recycling. We will go get some scratch-offs. And I'm not sure yet if I'm going to go to the chiropractor or not. I probably should. But, uh... I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what, what it's looking like time-wise. They open at 10. If I'm if I'm on my game and get out of work quick and get my other stuff done quick, then I don't want to sit there and wait for them to open. Um, but if things take a little time and I'm coming up Wade Hampton at that time, then I'll stop. Uh, I wouldn't normally come home Wade Hampton, so I guess we'll see actually before then. But, um, yeah. So that's it. That's all for today. Um, kind of wondering what the workhouse is going to be like today. Things are kind of getting back into the school routine, so there's maybe not quite as many people early. Maybe a few more people later. Like uh, if the moms and moms mostly, dads sometimes, if they don't work but have to get the kids to school, then they'll come after they drop the kids off, which means after 8 o'clock is a busier time than it is when school's not in. And, of course, that also means there are some people who get their workout done before work slash school. So, anyway, doesn't matter. I'm not sure if I can tell. Anyway, but maybe just a little bit of different traffic flow, so to speak. So, that's it. Go and drink my soda. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. Talk to you later. And, uh, peace out. Alright, so I didn't do what I said I was going to do. And pay attention to the time as I was coming up Wade Hampton. And, um, chose to listen to the end of a radio show I was listening to. Um, when I realized that, uh, that radio show does not end at 10 o'clock. It ends earlier. So the show ended and I got out of the truck to walk in and get my chiropractic adjustment and they were not open yet. Um, and I waited several more minutes until they did open. And the first person I saw, I didn't even get it inside. The first person I saw was Dr. Turd. Um, so either I misunderstood or Dr. Number 7 uh, messed up when he told me that he was not going to be there this Friday. So I left. <laughs> it's so bad that I dislike someone that much for no reason that I just couldn't even, I, I just couldn't. My back hurts. I'd love to have a good adjustment. But damn, I just don't like that dude. Anyway, so here we are at 10.02 and I'm, I'm heading home. Um, really fighting the urge to go get a spicy chicken biscuit at Chick-fil-A because I'm starving. But, uh, but I won't. I really want to. I'm so hungry. I don't know why I'm so hungry. I had my, in fact, I had more than my normal breakfast. Usually at work, I just have a protein bar and a little, small little cup of, of, uh, cashews. Today I had double the cashews 
and the protein bar, and I'm starving. Now, I don't know. My blood sugar was lower than normal uh, overnight, and then when I got up this morning, um, I tried to do... Well, I, I didn't try. I did better last night with dinner about not overeating. I didn't, I didn't eat uh, nearly as much as I normally would for dinner. Uh, and so maybe that's part of it. <laughs> that it's carryover, it's, it's hunger carryover, is that a thing? So, I don't know, because I'm still going to probably have to eat something when I get home, I just won't eat a spicy chicken biscuit. Oh, that sounds good though, doesn't it? Mm. So anyway, I'll get home, I'll, I'll feed and medicate my father, and then I'll go for a walk, and then I'll eat my regular, uh, my regular at-home breakfast. Uh, it's weird to call that breakfast since it's not going to be my first meal of the day. It's going to be my second. Man, my camera's shaking a lot there, isn't it? Sorry about that. Bumpy road, I guess. Or else I'm driving like a bat out of Hades. Um, so, excuse me. I'm going to probably need a nap today, too. I got more sleep than I did Tuesday night when I had to get up and work Wednesday morning. But uh, I stayed up probably an hour later than I, well, not should have, but I, I didn't go to bed as early as I could have, put it that way. Um, I, I went looking for a DVD, uh, I don't know what night it was this week, and, well, the one I was looking for wasn't there, but I, I came across another one I haven't watched in forever, and so I put it in the player, and ended up watching about half of it. So I'm guessing probably 45 minutes or so uh, of an old concert video. And it was it was fun to watch. Um, uh, it was called, it's a show of hands by Rush. Um, and I saw that tour. I, I saw Rush twice. And um, and it was great. And so it was. it's kind of nice to watch that DVD and, and relive the memory of seeing them um, live um, which we'll never do again uh, that kind of was in my head too it was like that's kind of sad to think that we'll never see Rush again um, but I get it somebody dies and the rest of the band says we're done but uh, what a band mm. I don't know if I'd say they're one of my top five favorites of all time but damn they're good so if you get a chance to see the Show of Hands video, the DVD, that's, that's a good representation of them. Uh, but like I said, it kept me from going to bed as early as I probably should have, could have. Um, and I'll probably finish watching the rest of it tonight. South, not Southampton, uh, Sheffield United and Nottingham Forest today at 3 o'clock. For whatever reason, there are no early games tomorrow, Premier League games that is, um, and I'll take it. That's good. I, I don't want to feel pressured to get up to watch that early uh, so I can sleep till my normal time or even later if I would like to tomorrow. It's supposed to get pretty hot again. Well, hotter today than it's been the last two days. Hotter tomorrow than today. Hotter on Sunday than tomorrow. And I'm just so over it. I always say I like the heat. And then when the heat comes, I'm like, okay, I'm, I like it for about two weeks and then I'm over it. Uh, but I do know, like, it's, it's not a cliche because it's the truth. The humidity just makes it so much worse. Um, yeah, so... That's that. I, uh... Oh, sorry. Anyway. That's it. That's me rambling. I, I'm gonna stop rambling and, and, uh... Go, go in the house here in just a second. I'm almost home. So, anyway. I may or may not curse you again later.